In the realm of ancient texts, the Bible stands as one of the most influential and revered. Today, we delve into the depths of a particular verse, 1 Chronicles 29, 11, which is nestled within the Old Testament in a book that often goes unnoticed. This verse is part of David's prayer of praise to God as he prepares to pass his kingship to his son, Solomon. Yours, Lord, is the greatness and the power and the glory and the majesty and the splendor for everything in heaven and earth is yours. Yours, Lord, is the kingdom. You are exalted as head over all. At its core, 1 Chronicles 29, 11 is a recognition and celebration of God's supreme sovereignty. The verse encapsulates the essence of God's character, highlighting His absolute greatness, power, glory, majesty, and splendor. It acknowledges that everything we see, from the boundless heavens to the diverse earth, is His creation and thus belongs to Him. The phrase, Yours, Lord, is the kingdom, underscores the fact that God reigns over all. He is the ultimate ruler, the King of all kings. The verse concludes with a proclamation of God's exaltation, His supreme status over all that exists. This verse, in essence, is a profound statement of faith, recognizing and submitting to the authority and magnificence of God. This verse serves as a reminder that God is the creator and ruler of all things. It emphasizes that all power, glory, majesty, and splendor belong to Him. It paints a picture of God's sovereignty, reminding us of His absolute authority over all creation. It is a call to acknowledge and revere God for His absolute supremacy. In the grand scheme of things, 1 Chronicles 29, 11 is a verse that encourages humility and reverence. It reminds us of our place in the universe and calls us to recognize the greatness of God. It is a verse that encapsulates the essence of faith, acknowledging and revering God's sovereignty and majesty. To sum up, 1 Chronicles 29, 11 is a verse of recognition, reverence, and humility. It acknowledges God's absolute sovereignty, His power, glory, majesty, and splendor. It is a reminder of our place in the universe, a call to humility, and a testament to the essence of faith. It underscores the fact that God is the ultimate ruler, the creator of all things, and the holder of all power and glory.